This tutorial is going to look at how to form a linear equation between two points. So these two points should lie on the equation, the line of the equation that we are going to create. So the first thing that we need to understand is the formula for a straight line graph. That is y equals mx plus c. And the m value is the gradient and the c value is the y-intercept, so where the graph crosses the y-axis. Now, one of the first things that we need to do is we need to find or calculate the gradient. Now, the gradient m is the difference in y divided by the difference in x. So we're talking about the coordinates. So if we look at the y coordinates, because we need the difference in y first, we have 19 and 3. So we need the difference, which is another word for the sub subtracting the 2. So 19 minus 3. So that's the difference in the y divided by. Now if we started with the 19, so we start with this coordinate first, we need to start with the x coordinate here, subtract this one. So we do 4 minus 0, the difference in the x. So remember whichever coordinate you start with, you need to start with the y, you need to do the corresponding one with the x. So we have 19 minus 3 is 16, and we have 4 minus 0 is 4. And 16 divided by 4 is 4. So that is the first part of my equation calculated. So I can start to write this y equals 4x plus c. Now the next step is to work out what the c value is. Now the question already gives us the c value, but I'm going to ignore that for a minute and I'm going to show you a different method to calculate it if you didn't recognize you'd already been given the c value. So. If you take one of the coordinates, so we'll take this one, which is an easier coordinate, the x value is 0, so when x equals 0, the y value is 3. And I'm going to substitute it into here. So I have my y value is 3. And I have 4 times my x value, so 4 times 0 plus c. So 3 equals 4 times 0 is 0, so 3 equals c. So my c value is 3. And now I'm just going to finish it off by putting it back into my formula. So y equals 4x plus 3. And that is the equation of my straight line between the two points given. Now, I said it just before that they'd already given us the c value, the y-intercept. Now, that's because they've given us this coordinate here, 0, 3. So if they give you a coordinate is 0 something, what they're telling you, if you think about a set of axes, if it's 0, 3, that points there, so it's on the y-axis. So if they give you a coordinate that's zero something, they've already given you the c-value, so you don't need to do this extra stage, but I did it just to clarify. So the equation, the straight line, y equals 4x plus 